everyone, Lois here, and I thought I'd bring some recent news related to Pokemon Go. If you like this video, please hit the like button. Be sure to subscribe to the channel and hit the bell for alerts of when I upload new content to the channel, especially those with disabilities similar to mine. This week, Niantic has announced a couple of things. One, it's Valentine's Day event called Carnival of Love which will make the debut of Oracle as a shiny. The event bonuses include increased chance of receiving XL candies when walking with your buddy and two guaranteed XL candies for evolving Pokemon. You can also find shiny fur through and change it into its heart trim form and depending on which part of the world you are in you'll be able to find or Coracle's forms ballet style will be available in Europe the Middle East and Africa pom pom style will be available in in North Central and South America's Palu style will be available in Africa, Asian Pacific, and the Caribbean Islands, and Sensu style will be available in the Asian Pacific region. And you'll also be able to find Flabebe other forms like Red Flower Flabebe in Europe, the Middle East. And Africa, blue for Bebe in the Asian Pacific region, and yellow for Bebe in the Americas. And depending on, and of course, no matter what part of the world you are in, orange and white flower for Bebe will also be available. The following Pokemon you'll be able to catch as shinies for this event include Snubble, Skitty, Love Disc. Furfru, all styles of Orcorco, Stuffle, and Roselia. While the following Pokemon are not available as shinies, all the forms of Fabebe, Quaxley, and yeah, I meant to say and Quaxley. For field research encounters, you'll be able to get Snubble, Roselia. Spinda with a heart pattern, Clam Pearl, Love Disc, Furfru, and Stuffle. All these Pokemon are available as Shinies. There will also be a collection challenge, and one of the rewards for this will be a Roserade. You'll also be able to get some Valentine's Day inspired items for your avatar. There will also be Poke Showcases. And there will also be an exclusive bonus for trainers in Brazil, along with a paid time research, which will cost one dollar or equal equivalent currency, depending on which part of the world you are in. In other Pokemon news, also announced the events for the next upcoming season with March's Community Day being on March 16th. Two Community Days in April, one of them being a Community Day Classic on April 7th. The normal Community Day on April 20th and May Community Day. As of this recording, we don't know which Pokemon will be featured for these Community Day events. There will also be additional in-game events on the 3rd of March, the 13th of April, the 28th of April, and the 11th of May. Stay tuned as further details about these events will, will come. Also, this weekend will be Hisuian Descendui Raid Day, which will be 
this Sunday, February 11th, from 2 p.m. to 5 p.m. local time, and you'll be able to catch Shiny Descend Do I in its Hisuian form if you get lucky during raids. There will also be a ticket which will allow you to have bonuses for more remote raid passes and regular raid passes from spinning photo discs at gyms. One more thing. I have a lot of videos that will be coming up this year and I'll also be covering Sinnoh Tour later this month and as for shiny catches they will be moved to the beginning of the middle of this video of the of the of the community day or special event videos like I did recently with Chansey Community Day and I like to give a shout out to my mentor Jono of Jono Plays for giving me this idea. Thanks for watching everyone. You can also follow me on Instagram, Threads, Twitch, TikTok, and Facebook. And remember, it's time for adventure. <laughs>